disclaimer, watch at your own risk. These three innocent people are going to do something crazy. Yes, I'm talking about pumpkin carving. None of these three people have ever done this job. It's a part of Halloween, which is celebrated in most Christian countries. We three are housemates and I bought this pumpkin recently. Uh, I don't know why I bought. I was maybe fascinated by the big size of the pumpkin and the yellowness. Actually, I plan to uh, make some recipe out of it. But this Saturday, I thought about maybe try making uh, something out of this pumpkin, pumpkin carving, I mean. And here you can see, I tried to do pumpkin carving with my intuition. And you can see I removed all the seeds and after removing seeds through a round cut on the top I tried to google for some images and I could find a nice and simple design of a smiling um, ghost pumpkin ghost this is what you can say and here you can see using a ball pen I'm trying to carve uh, the design uh, honestly speaking, I struggled because I am neither a good artist nor a carpenter. I mean, if I didn't knew about this tradition, I would assume that some carpenter uh, might be, you know, hired to do this work. But many would disagree with me that it's not carpenter. It's an artistic work and I do agree. That's why. An artist is carving this uh, it's me yeah you can look at it how nicely I'm carving I know you may feel like I am praising myself but that's what I'm good at yeah you got it right I'm not good at carving but I'm good at praising myself yeah it's a feel good good situation uh, you can see now that the eye you know, I almost made an eye out of this pumpkin. I never imagined that I could do this. And you know what my housemates are doing while I am doing this? So one of the housemates, Sam, is playing video game. Yeah, it sounds terrible. Mm, I mean, whatever he wants to do. And the other housemate is cooking. Uh, but I'm glad he's helping me with filming. I mean, he don't have uh, any options uh, because I would, you know, piss him off by, you know, repeatedly requesting for clicking the videos. Anyway, uh, I know once this pumpkin is successfully carved, Sam will join us and we will have more fun. So until then, Bear with me and watch me carving a pumpkin cast. Yeah, this little nose took me some time to figure out. But when you are carving a pumpkin, you also need to remove, you know, the inner side of the, the, the pumpkin mass. I try to actually explain something because while... Filming this video, I thought that, okay, maybe I can talk and make the video. But I realized that it was not a great idea, but still you can see me talking. That that shows my effort. I mean, that's not an editing error. error. So, uh, yeah, you might have also realized that I fumbled with error and error. It happened often. You know why? Because I am still trying to be a... English man. Yeah, my my lady is not an English woman, uh, but I am trying to be an English man because that's how I thought about making this video in English. So um, 
Again, you see, it's show. No, it's so. Okay, please ignore my nonsense and um, just focus on how uh, nicely I have carved. Now, I'm carving the two teeth of this uh, pumpkin ghost nicely. And you will notice how I am trying to, you know, make it smoother by first removing the, the pain marks. I think it's almost gone. And now I'm cutting the inner mass, inner side of the pumpkin to make it like more 3D, you know, 3D, uh, three dimensional view. And at the back, you see, uh, you know, dehumidifier, dehumidifier, no, humidifier, sorry. So it often gets very dry during winter. So we have this humidifier and also those, you know, twinkle, twinkle light. I mean, it's not twinkling, but I don't know. I don't know the word for that because you know that I'm not an English man. Okay. That's a nice excuse um, when I'm falling short of my English word. Okay. Um, so now I'm trying to, uh, now you see that pumpkin ghost has been fully carved. Although there is some notch in the eyes, that's imperfection. And you know, sometimes imperfection are better, especially when it's from your side. And I put some pumpkin in the mouth of the, the the pumpkin ghost. And I also put a red color. And you see the ghost is ready. Ting ting. And pumpkin ghost has eaten some pumpkins. So the inner mass has been scattered and the skull is now open. Now we have to wait for the ghost. The real ghost. Yeah. Ghost number yeah. one. <laughs> Very nice. <laughs> this is the old lady ghost. I mean, she is the old lady who died in her childhood. <laughs> this is the zombie. It's me. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Almost fluttering like I had some. <laughs> Actually, it's pumpkin in my mouth and also peanut butter and blueberries and all the fruits. And now I'm introducing you to the guy. I mean, it's a ghost, but I never felt like he's a ghost. He had banana in his mouth and he cannot even puke. <laughs> this is again a drunk, crazy ghost. Yeah, the camera was scared of this ghost. And here we can ask. And this is happy three of us. I hope you enjoyed.